So nobody at this point in our politics in Nigeria, I don't think anyone has the right to stay on the sidelines, to be honest. It would be criminal if anybody, seeing everything that's going on right now, decides, oh, I want to stay on the sidelines. It doesn't bother me. It's not my problem. It's not my concern. So nothing keeps me up. I do everything I know I can do, and I go to sleep well, well, without any worries. So having said that, I want us to really, we have less than 100 days to the election. Pretty much everybody knows what I, what, who I stand for in this panel. We have less than 100 days. My question is, what are we doing? What, what is there? What is left to be done that we, we have not yet done? Who are the people that we ought to speak to that we have not yet spoken to? Now, having said that, a lot of people will not, ask, they, will, they don't believe in the new Nigeria. There's some people on the extreme end that are just saying burn everything to the ground. There are people who don't care. There are people who are holding on to their candidates, even though they see clearly the child, even the blind, the deaf, and whatever, can see that this person does not have the capacity to move the country forward. We know that, but those of us that are fighting hard for Peter the Rock Obi, what are we doing about it? What are we doing about it? Are we putting our money where our mouth is? Because at the end of the day, if that country sinks, guess what? It's gonna affect all of us. It's not just gonna affect some people. It's not gonna affect, affect one, one ethnic group to and leave the others, everybody will cry. Everybody will be served the breakfast. Okay? So I want us to stay focused for those of us that believe that Nigeria is still salvable. We can still do something. We can turn it around. And it's worth fighting for. For those of us who believe in it, we need to do what we must do to ensure that we have the right, sensible, common sense leader, Peter the Rock will be in that office so we can start to walk from the ground up because guess what? The work we have is, is humongous. We have not even scratched the surface. We're only talking election politics right now, but the work that we have is so much. I, I 